So, what's up with y'all that y'all claim to be, y'all supposed to be targeted individuals? Y'all glorify yourselves as part of the 144,000 and chosen ones. Well, how can you call yourself targeted and chosen? And you don't have any godly discernment. If you see a perp bullying a TI, a target individual, or if you see a fake TI perp harassing and bullying a real target, and you prefer them because they're more popular, well, you defend and agree with them and you side with them. So, like, stop calling yourself a chosen one or chosen by God or part of 144,000 God's chosen elect. If you defend and agree with narcissistic abusers, gang stalkers, and fake TI perps. Like, how, you can't call yourself chosen by God and you don't even have any wisdom, I mean, wisdom and discernment, and you follow the herd, you follow the crowd without an independent mind of your own, or allowing the Holy Spirit to real, let you realize that, wait a minute, you know, something ain't right here. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get into this mess. But the real victim or the real sufferer, y'all sit there and um, gang up on that person and leave them isolated, and y'all want to defend and agree with who's more popular and well-liked and, and the fakest people. Like, why don't y'all, if you profess to be a real targeted individual and a chosen one, why are you acting like you don't have discernment? You follow the wicked. You follow the evil. You defend and agree with evil. And you say you guys chosen. Something is not right with that. You know, it really hurts me that, you know, y'all walk around narcissistic and abusive with elitist mentality and then defend and agree with the evildoers and shun the righteous ones. And then manipulate and turn everybody away from, you know, the support. 